All right, ladies and gentlemen, um, we're doing some graphing inequalities. Well, let's get started, okay? Enough talk, man. So they've already graphed this for us. All right, now the things you need to know about graphing an inequality. Um, it's just like graphing the line, except you're going to have either a dotted or solid on the line, and you're going to shade one side or the other, okay? Um, here we go. So first thing you do, just like in graphing a line, you graph the y-intercept first, okay? So in this line that we've already got up here, they put one at positive one. That means that crosses the y-axis at one. Now, from there, we count with the slope. Count m, which is the slope. That's 3 over 1. So we'd go up 3, 1, 2, 3, over 1. Now, you notice I ran out of room? That's okay. You can make them both negatives because if we simplify it, what would negative 3 over negative 1 be? Still be 3. So you go down 3, 1, 2, 3, back 1. And then you have a line right there, just like that. Now, the next thing you need to know that has to deal with inequalities is you would say dotted or solid. Okay? If it is this or this, it's dotted. If it's this or this, it's solid. Okay, this one up here was not equal to. That's what that means to. Greater than or equal to, less than or equal to. Means it can be on that line. This means that it's just above or below it. Okay, that's why it's a dashed line. Now there's a couple ways to figure out which side to shade. Um, I always say shade. Um, shade your life <laughs> that didn't make sense okay um, one way to do it is just pick a coordinate pick any coordinate over here on this side or this side if it works shade the side with the coordinate easy way to do it plug in zero zero all right so for instance here I'm gonna plug it into this equation so it'll be zero is less than and then zero times three is zero zero plus one is one is zero less than one Yes, it is. So I would shade the side that has the coordinate 0, 0. All right, let's do a couple example problems, then I'll shut my mouth. Okay, they want us to graph this right here. No problem. First, I start with my y-intercept, which would be 1, 2, 3, negative 3. There you go. Now, the slope is negative 2, which we know is negative 2 over 1. So I would go down 2 over 1. Now, I run out of spot, space, so I'm just going to switch the negative down here, which you can do. So go up two, back one, up two, back one, up two, back one. See what I'm doing? Cool, cool, cool. Dotted or solid? Well, it says that it is not equal to, therefore it's a dotted. I'd say dotted dash, whatever you want to say. And you're done with that. Now, last step, which what side do we shade? I recommend doing zero, zero. Let's plug it in. Zero for the y is greater than negative two times zero minus three, which this cancels out. It's zero, good job. Okay, so you've got zero is greater than negative three. Is that true? Yeah, zero is bigger than a negative, duh. So therefore we include this. So we shade all this junk right here. Okay, let's do the last one. All right, graph x plus y is greater than or equal to three. Okay. Uh, okay, problem. Don't tell us what to do. Okay, don't do it. I live my life. Let's work the problem. Stop talking, Tyler. Okay, so um, easy way to do this, it's in standard form. So we could just say that cover up the x, y is 3, and then we just cover up the y, which is an x here. x is 3 as well. Okay, now dotted or dashed line? Well, don't get crazy. I know you want to put a dotted line or dashed, whatever. Um, it's a solid line because it's greater than or equal to. That means it can be on this line, therefore it is a solid line. Now let's just plug our stuff in and see if we shade above or below. Again, I'm going to use 0, 0. So that means 0 plus 0 is greater than or equal to 3. Is that true? Is 0 greater than or equal to 3? No, it's not. Therefore, you don't include the origin, which we chose, and you shade above it. Now, let's say I wanted to find the solution set, which is everything that fits into this right here. Well, we know we shaded. Um, we can't go below this, so therefore it stops here. We know we can't go past this, so we stop here. And then for the red, is there any restrictions on it? Not really. The sucker includes all the other stuff. So we're just going to shade all that little fella. 
and we're done. That's what's up. If you got a few extra seconds, I'd really appreciate it if you would subscribe to my YouTube channel. Really appreciate that. Also, you know I'm on that Instagram if you want to search Tyler Tarver. I'm on that Twitter. I can't write Twitter. <laughs> and then Facebook. You can check out Tyler Tarver is okay. Facebook. Thanks, guys. Um, just have the best day ever, if you could, please.